Hey y'all, I'm glad to come at you. So, I already coated this one. And it still stinks. Oh man, it stinks bad. But, it didn't take much. You shoot it on there. Yeah, it's supposed to be textured and all that stuff. And it's a non-skid surface. So, it didn't take long to get it out there. This stuff sprays pretty, pretty fast. So, I'm going to stick these up here. Hopefully you can see it. And uh, I'll get this thing done. Hey, Cover everything up, make sure there's nothing in the, you know, the mechanicals and all that. And I didn't get it in there because that actually get, fits on top of that. So I'm just going to spray this out real quick and uh, let it dry. Oh man, this stuff is nasty. Stinky stuff. Sorry. <laughs> Definitely want to do this in a well ventilated area, like an open garage. You should definitely clean the crap out of your way. But I think, I think I'm gonna do it. I'll let her dry a few hours and then uh, that'll be it. So uh, yeah, Rust-Oleum truck bed pro grade paint and primer in one there it is la di da it was like 13 bucks i didn't want to use that other one the uh it holds it in it's it like messing with it I'm like, so uh now i'm waiting to get from my let this dry peel all the stuff off the bottom's covered up because there's weep holes in the bottom, and I don't want them covered. I want them to leak out. So, yes, it'll be red paint on the very bottom, whatever. 
it'll be alright. So there we go. La di da. Done and done. And then when it's all dry, I'll put it back together and doesn't get the tractor done. I get to I get to pull this out. This is leaking. Pull it out and I'll repatch it. And then when I get that done, I can put this thing up on uh, saw horses and work on it. But uh, yeah, it's coming out pretty well. Not bad. A lot of crap. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna work on on the saw horses. This was okay, but I really wanted to see how it worked, and it worked out good. I'm gonna get another can of that. But uh, so yeah, that's what I'm doing. So now I'll just sit there and dry, and I don't know few hours I'm, I'm sure maybe even overnight I don't know I'll have to look at that can what does it say dry time oh man that is small where are my glasses I can't see it I can't see what it says what happens when you get old your eyes start to go and they make the print so small you can't read it. Oh, there we go. Oh, my friend Cheryl got me another shirt. I'm thinking. I do that a lot. Oh, really? Wow, they're talking a couple days. <laughs> Okay. Eh, whatever. It'd be all right. Oh. So. Oh, and I got the... And this. This is for the... To fill in the stuff on the... On here. I gotta clean them up. Sand it down. See it? Now you can really see it. All the pitting. I'm gonna fix the pitting on that one. And definitely that one. That one's really bad. And maybe, maybe this one. The gray is a filler primer. I might do a little bit on that one. But really, there's a the non-skid thing goes over top of that, so I don't know that I'm gonna do that. But uh, so yeah, that's the plan. So uh, can't really do nothing until I get my uh. The patch kit for the mowers and get the mower out of here and then put that up on the um, up on the saw horses because I need I got two but I need like four five so yeah anyway I'm gonna get out of here and uh, go back inside and edit some more video and see how this one came out see if it looks okay and uh, yeah Maybe I'll clean the garage. Maybe after I did that stuff dry for a while. But um, be good. Good at it. Good to yourselves, your friends, your family, your loved ones. And uh, if it's nice outside, it's kind of nice. Try to get outside if you can. And uh, God bless and I'll see you.